Hi, I'm Vernon Tyndall with Cambium Networks. I'm here today to show you a little bit about the Cambium WISP Toolbox. It's a set of tools the RTMs have created over the years to help, help us troubleshoot networks like yours. We realized that these tools would be handy for everyday operations. So a quick glimpse of what we have. We have a, a menu system that's database driven, so you can add any shortcuts you want. The idea is that we sort of have a web interface where you're installers on a daily basis can hook in and they've got quick links to everything they need or maybe even your technical support personnel. So with this menu system you can go in and add, delete, change. You don't even have to link to the same system. You could add shortcuts to say the Cambium website. We also have a centralized file storage. It makes it easy for you to put in the latest firmware since this is a place your installers might come to grab firmware for their daily needs you can stick it on there and it's a handy place for them to go download it easy to find with a editable directory structure the next thing was a free radius front end we realize a lot of operators want to use a centralized authentication for their networks with the new systems that Cambium has come out with the PMP 320 and now version 11 of Canopy they all use radius since Free Radius is an open source tool, we decided to write a nice front end for it that's really designed for our products. This front end makes it easy for you to go in and add accounts, super easy for day-to-day -day maintenance, easy to set up group administration so that you can sell different tiered services without a lot of hassle. More importantly, with the PMP320 system, you can click and push all of the QoS profiles to the radios. This really simplifies provisioning the access points as well as maintains consistency between the back-end authentication and what's out in the field on the towers. Another tool that helps us for troubleshooting is Syslog. We know a lot of people would like to have Syslog anytime you have a support issue something that support might ask for is a Syslog of when the event happened and Syslog can be a mountain of logs, a huge amount of flat text files impossible to sift through. We make it easy with our front end. Point all your access point syslog to this. It's all logged to a database. Simple to filter. If you know what time the event was, filter from a couple of minutes before till a couple of minutes after and you instantly get a list of all of, these, all of the syslog events for that period. Click the export button and it's one file you can send to support really speeds up the process of trying to sift through those syslogs. The last and probably coolest thing is the network-wide spectrum scan. We know when we ask for spectrum scans, it's really impractical on a large deployed network to, to get a decent spectrum scan. If you change one access point to spectrum scan mode, all it sees is the other APs on the tower. And even if you change the whole tower, well now all it sees is your adjacent towers. And it's really hard to get a clear picture of what's out there besides you. With MaxScan, add all of your access points, tell it to run a spectrum scan, and it goes out, changes all access points on your network to spectrum scan mode, collects the spectrum scan results, and then reconfigures your access points back to operational mode. The results are collected in, in a s database and easy to come back and view later. You can even store them forever and come back and compare from time to time. Easy to export it to Excel if you want to chart how the spectrum looks at each access point or if you filter by a s simple access point, single access point, you can pull up charts for each spectrum for each AP after the scan's done. This tool is intended to be released as open source. We expect there's going to be more tools added to it as time goes on, and we're hoping that a lot of those tools come from you, the WISP community.